So in this video, we'll see how can we calculate the values when working with AngularJS application. For example, we have a number of text boxes and we want to create some expressions. So as we saw, like we can use double curly braces for passing the expressions. Let's see here in one more example, how can we make the practical implementation. So here in this uh, program, we'll see how we can use the expressions of AngularJS. So in the head, you can see that as always, I have used the angular.js file. After that, there is a script file. Uh, there is a script thing, right? We are not uh, focusing on that in this tutorial, right? So you can see that the, the styles have been used here in the class format. So uh, as I said in the beginning, like you should have the basic knowledge of the CSS. So that's what we have implemented here. After that, right here in the table, we have taken four rows in the first I'm, I have taken a text box for first name, text box for the last name, then the third text box for the quantity and the fourth text box for the cost. So you can see like in each row I have used the ng model for binding the value. And right here in the fifth row or in the last what we have done is we have created an expression on the ng click. So here we actually have initialized a variable called message where first we concatenate the first name with the last name then a literal string has to pay then a cost into quantity all right and we can render the same uh, message variable right here in the second lex td as an expression you can see there are double curly braces so let's see how the output will look like here in this case so as soon as I will enter the first name, let's say tutorials, last name point, quantity, let's say 30, cost, let's say 50. So when I click here, you can see the calculation with an expression like tutorials point has to pay this amount. All right. So this is how you can generate the expressions and you can print them either by using these uh, expressions in the double curly braces or using the ng bind.